Hi, I'm Veronica Blade and welcome to Parents Corner. Today, we're going to cover the correct way to teach the sound of the letter Q. If you look on the internet, pretty much everything that pops up tells you the sound to the letter Q is qua. But remember, not everything you see on the internet is true. The sound of Q is just k, and I'm going to prove it to you. But before we get into that, my purpose in doing these videos is to make your teaching smoother and help your student learn faster. If a child is gonna spend two years or more just to learn the alphabet, uppercase letters, lowercase letters, and sounds to eventually read a three letter word, let's do everything we can to shorten that time. What your student learns in the beginning is gonna be the foundation and getting that right should make the letter steps easier. Okay, so Q. Q is almost always with the letter U. And when U is with a Q, the U sound usually, not always, makes a W sound, W, as in quit. The Q sound is just K, just K, not qua. The U is making the W sound. The Q is just going K. Now let's go over some other words where the U is making the W sound with other letters, not Q. Like when it comes after a G, as in guar, guava, penguin. The U is making the W sound. Sometimes U is after an S and it makes the W sound again. Suave, suede. There are a couple of Latin-based words that begin with C-U and the sound is qua, as in quattro. That's a musical instrument that's like a guitar. So the U is making the W sound, whether it's with a Q, a C, a G, or an S. It's the U making the W sound, not the Q. Q is just K. Now let's look at some words where Q and U are together, but the U does not make a W sound. It's silent. The Q, as always, is just K, but no W sound with it. Here are some words. Liquor, unique, peak, opaque, mosque, basque. You see that? The Q is just K there, just K. And then there are a couple words when Q has no U after it at all, like cut. It's Q-A-T, it's type of plant. And then there is the country of Qatar that's spelled Q-A-T-A-R. There's no U and the Q is just and here's an interesting one. If you talk to someone from Quebec, they'll pronounce it as Quebec. No U sound there, even though there is a U. Americans may pronounce it as Quebec, but Canadians from Quebec say Quebec, except they say it with a French accent, which I can't do. Now, why am I dedicating an entire video to this? Because if you teach the sound to Q as qua, then later, when they're trying to sound out a word where there is no U, like Qatar, or the U is silent, like liquor or unique, they're going to have a difficult time. And up the road, when they come across U with other letters like C, G, or S that we covered earlier, they won't necessarily know that the U makes the W sound there. So they're going to have a hard time figuring it out. So let's make it easier for them. And that's it. I hope I've been successful in proving to you how the correct sound to the letter Q is just K. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. If you have any questions, feel free to shoot an email to info at firststepphonics.com and we'll do our best to answer you. I might even make a video to answer your question. You can check out our books and workbooks as well as other teaching aids at firststepphonics.com. As always, be patient, be encouraging, be the teacher you wish you had. Thank you so much for watching.